Good morning, Hoover Math and Science Academy students and staff. Hi, my name is Haley, and I'm coming to you live from the haunted Hoover studio. Today is Halloween, Friday, October 31st, 2014. In weather today, the village of Schomburg is expected to have a high of 40 and a low of 29 with rain and snow showers. Now please stand us and join in, now please stand and join us in saying our nation's pledge. Our pledge people for today are Dakota. Amy. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. In sports, Patrick Sharp scored the winning goal in overtime, leading the Blackhawks to a 5-4 to four win over the Ottawa Senators last night. The Bulls will play the Cleveland Cavaliers tonight at 7 o'clock. And the Bears do not play this weekend. Clubs meeting today are... The Green Thumb Club, Group B, in room 103 at 11 o'clock. Hoover's Costume Parade will start at 1 o'clock this afternoon. Students will be able to change into their costumes beginning at 12.30. And now a word from our spooktastic principal and vice principal, Mr. Smelger and Miss Stephanie. <laughs> Good morning, Hoover. Hopefully you're having a great Halloween so far. Things are a little off today in the studio. We've got floating heads going all over the place. It's kind of creepy. All right, we're going to pull some positive paws here. So Miss Stephanie's going to pull from the blue eggs. All right. Let's see who's been showing. Great, ex great respectful, responsible, and safe behavior. In room 203, Alicia Verma. In room 203, Alicia W. Can't read that name. Make sure you write legibly. Did I call these positive? These are Herbie high fives. <laughs> wow. Room 203, Lily. It looks like room 203 is getting a lot of these Herbie They've high fives. they loaded the bucket here. <laughs> All right. We already have her. I'm going to pull one more. Room 203, Celine. Right. It's a spectacular day today, guys. In room 118, Malachi. In room 118, Curious. Curious. In room 118, Kason. All right, let's see. In room 118, Alexa, it looks like 203 and room 118 are really doing what they should be. So we need some of the other classes to remember to turn in their Herbie high fives. All right, we've got the special uh, respectful to peers and adults high fives that we've been giving out all month. This is the culminating day. We're going to pull some out. We've got, let's see, Chris in room 113, Addison in room 118. This one doesn't have a room on it at all. Let's see, we've got uh, Rainy in 214. Malachi in room 118. Julian in room 118. 118, great job. Uh, here's one, let's see, we've got Gabby in 115. We'll do two more. Let's see, Alexa in room 118. We're going to dig all the way to the bottom for this one. It is Jessica in room 202. Congratulations to all the students that got their names pulled and to everybody for earning all of these Herbie high fives. There are a lot of them. Continue to show respectful and responsible and safe behavior. And remember, be the reason someone smiles today. Have a great day or not. The choice is yours.
Thank you, Mr. Schmauser and Miss Stepney. Here is today's fun fact. When trick-or-treating first became popular in the United States in the 1800s, children mostly played silly pranks. By the 1950s, the focus switched to good old family fun with children dressed in costumes going door to door asking for candy. That's all for today. This week's pre-broadcast pictures and sign-offs were brought to you by the first graders in room 105. Boo-rific job, first graders. Have a safe and, safe and happy Halloween Friday. Woo!